So who's Miana? You are. Oh, how much are you paying me again? Five dollars. Ten? Nine. Ten fifty? Ten fifty. Welcome to Beyond the Business Network News. I hope you enjoy your show. Have a lovely day. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Beyond the Business Network News. For today's top story, please be aware that there are two females on the run stealing grass. One is of a dark complexion, the other is of a light complexion. Wait, doesn't that sound like the two people we just hired? Well, uh, <laughs> in other news, the owner of McDonald's has opened a new franchise, Water To Go, where they serve water to go. <laughs> Much better than the food they have now. Mm hmm Tragically, six people died this week due to double dabbing. The 22 witnesses from a local drama class observed that the victims were in a complicated relationship and dressed in bed sheets. A local couple is blaming a possessed doll for the tragic ending of their daughter's life, Lucy who fell down the stairs late October. Now, let's go to Kayla, who's interviewing the grieving couple. Thank you, Lissa. I'm here with Mrs. and Mrs. DeBron. You say that a doll killed your daughter? Yes, Annabelle was the doll's name. She lured our daughter down the stairs one night and pushed her down there. Do you still own the doll? No, we had it burned and sent to the dump after what it did to us. Oh my gosh, she tried to tell us if I just would have listened to her, maybe she would still be here. Don't blame yourself. We all had a role in this. You're right. I shouldn't blame myself. It was your great eyes. Wait, what? No! <laughs> um, go! Cut. For today. Tune in next time for more Biana Business Network news. Anyone got any grass? If you do, hit me up at 1-800-GOT-GRASS. Goodbye! You've been watching Bianca Business Network. Now back to your show. Are you in need of a new security system? Yes. Are you in need of a cool new toy that is perfect for any child? Yeah. yeah. Well, the Kit Cam is perfect for every family. How can a child's toy possibly work as a security camera? Well, it's quite simple. Let's invite our beautiful assistant to explain how it works. As you can see, this doll is equipped with the world's smallest camera with three modes, thermal, regular, and night vision. It has a microphone under its head and motion sensors on its neck and shoulders. We'll take one now. Yay, I want one with a pink dress. I'm gonna name it Penelope. Wonderful. Let's check in and see how they're doing with their kick cam right now. I just love my new doll. We're playing hide and go seek right now. Penelope, don't dare stop. house in the block. They all have some good stuff in here. Dude, but what if they have those doll things? Oh! Ugh. Okay, we've got enough time. Okay. Come on! TV? Do you see the TV? How are we going to get it down? I don't know. We oh, can't. We'll, we'll find a way. How much money can we get off of this? Maybe a couple thousand dollars. so much. Um, we're still rolling. Turn it off! You've been watching Beyond a Business Network. Enjoy your show. This summer, I can't believe them crazy girls are stealing our grass again. A thriller mm -hmm. comedy. Doris, why are you always talking about them cows in the grass? Like no other. But they're so weird, Nana. The cows are coming. What grass? To a television screen near you. Up grass. Hey, you're watching Beyond.
Kiana Business Network. You better like your show. Hello, I'm Dr. Susan Schwartz, the creator of the K-Camp, and I'm here today to tell you how this wonderful contraption works. As you can see, its eyes are equipped with high-tech lenses that can sense even the slightest movements. It is programmed with several forms of defense to protect your home and child, including karate and jiu-jitsu. I believe we have a clip of this now. Take it down. Sorry about that. Let's go ahead and move on to our next clip. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Those people must have one of those K cam things. Hey, you, give us everything you got. We, no. Please, please, no! <laughs> hey, were you the person that just robbed that poor girl in the clip? Get her! Watching Beyond a Business Network News. Gotta eat. Hello, and welcome to another game of Book Wars, where the person with the most book knowledge wins. Why don't we meet our lovely contestants for today? Contestant number one, what's your name? I'm Laura, and I love Harry Potter so much. And why do you think you can win today's game? Because I have more books than friends, and I am proud of it. How sad. Contestant number two, what's your name? I'm Kate, and I'm a cow. And why do you think you can win today's game? Because I'm a cow. How interesting. Contestant number three, what's your name? I'm Kayla and I love to read. And why do you think you can win today's game? Because I read all the time. Okay, let's just jump right in. We all know the rules. There are three rounds and three questions per round. Round one, each question counts for one point. And round two, each question counts for two points. And in round three, each question counts for three points. For every point, you get a book. The person at the end with the most books wins. If you know, if you think you know the answer to the question, just clap. Can I slap the table, please? Clap. Fine. Okay. I see we have our questions for today. Round one is on Harry Potter. <laughs> question number one. What secret name do Harry, Ron, and Hermione use to refer to Cyrus Black? A. Snuffles. B. Percy. C. Dumbbutt. Snuffles. Correct. Question number two. How many chocolate frog cards does Ron estimate he has? A. 20. B. 300. C. 500. Laura? 300. Wrong. It was 500. <laughs> Sorry, but no one gets these points for that question. Question number three. How many points is the golden snitch worth? A. 150. B. 200. C. 250. 150. Correct. <laughs> that concludes round one. Laura is in the lead with two. Kate and Kayla are with zero. It can still turn around really quick, so don't get cocky. Okay. Round number two is on the Hunger Games, and these questions are worth two points each. Question number one. True or false? In the first book, Peter Malark lost the leg. False. That is false. The answer is true. Peter did not lose a leg. When did he wait, lose a no, leg? Wait, no, he did not. He? he did too. Show it. Show me the part of the book his... right now. No, he didn't lose his leg. He never lost his leg. He never lost his leg. Okay, okay. let's he move never on. Lost his leg. Let's move on. What the heck? That is wrong. Your answer is wrong. I cannot play this game. That is true. District 12. Kate. District 12. Wrong. The answer Dang. was District 2. Boy! 
Why? <laughs> now nobody gets the point. Now we are moving on to our final and death round. Where death? the series, I'm already dead. Oh, sorry. The series is The Mortal Instruments. I don't know that series. That is unfair. Too bad. Uh, well, I read this a long time ago. So these questions are worth no, three okay, points sir. each. Question number one. <laughs> By the end of the series, how many last names has Jace had? A, one. B, two. C, three. Or D, four. Kayla. D. Correct. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> what the? Hell? What? I don't remember any of this. What? <laughs> what? 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 Why would you have? Wait, what did you get? Three books? Yeah, that's three books. Yeah, that's three books. They're, They're just like really They're really thin. thin. Okay, oh, question yeah, number two. two. What is the name of the gray Persian cat that inhabits the New York Institute? A. The cat. B. Stout. Or C. Church. Kate. Church. Correct. And I am so oh! <laughs> no, you unfortunately thing. did not clap first. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I am clapping with you. Right and right. the final question of the day. Oh, Lord. Cleary's friend is a vampire who can walk in the sunlight. The other people of the Shadow World call him a A. Vampire. B. Daylighter. Or C. Vampire who can withstand light. Kayla. B. Correct. Oh! oh <laughs> Good job, Kayla! Oh, ew. Okay. That was not fair. Wait, can I read this? Like, so so now, why don't we tally up books? Shut up! Tally assistant, would you please help? It's obvious. Oh, okay. It's kind of obvious. It's kind of obvious. Uno, I literally got two, one round. Three, four, five. Four. Uno, two, three. Five hundred. She win! Yeah! Let's all congratulate Kayla. Why don't you come up here to the front? Boo. Why don't you tell us what Boo. you're going to do with the 500 books you just won? Five more books! Ooh, and that concludes you. today's game of Book Wars. Please join us next week for a new show with new contestants. And I'm going to win that round! I'm a cow! Ugh. Goodbye! Hi, I'm Lissa, and you're watching the Out of Business Network. Stay tuned for bloopers. Hi, I'm Lisa, and you're watching the Viana Business News. With my parents, I didn't want children. <laughs> Wrong clip. Take it down. I'm really sorry about that. How about we move on to our next clip? <laughs> Wrong clip. Take it down. Sorry about that. Let's go ahead and move on to our next clip. Wrong clip. Sorry about that. Now let's go ahead and move on to, wait, hold on. Hello, I'm Dr. Doofenshmirtz, the creator of the Kid Cam, and I'm here today to tell you how this wonderful contraption works. As you can see, its eyes are equipped with high-tech lenses that can even, notice even the, um, hello, I, other than spiders, is that some little kid is going to come up and mug me, because these kids are getting too crazy these days. You right! <laughs> oh, you're crying! Brianna, are you okay? Are no, you okay? I'm not okay. You, call 911! Get the AED! Someone get the Coast Guard! <laughs> the Coast Guard? What? It's a joke. It's a, it's a winter coat. Yeah, it's a winter coat. <laughs> I need tissues. I know it's Where are the tissues? Hello? Wait, is it the Did you, did you get that? <laughs> no! <laughs> and welcome to Biana Business Network News. You've been watching Biana Business Network. Oh crap. Oh, go now. Wait, it's. I just love my new doll. What's her name? Oh, like three seconds of video. To, like, do it again, 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 do it again. Come on, come on. Do it again. Five, six, seven, eight. Work. Work.